Local officials from Davao Oriental and Davao City met with Mayor Rodrigo Duterte yesterday in Davao City. Joy Domingo will tell us why. Various local officials from Davao Oriental and Davao City meet with Davao City Mayor Rodrigo Duterte yesterday here in Davao City to express their support for the mayor's candidacy to become the next president of the republic. Among those who met with the mayor were Davao Oriental Vice Governor Mayo Almario, Congressman Thelma Almario, NPC, 1st District Congressman Carlo Nograles of NUP, and 3rd District Congressman Isidro Ungab, former LP, along with their constituent barangay officials. I would like to welcome and thank the team of uh, uh, Congresswoman Thelma Almario for finally uh, joining and supporting uh, the incoming president, uh, Mayor Rodrigo Duterte. As you can see, uh, kami dito nandito sa harap ninyo is from different political parties. And yet, ang common ground natin lahat is sumusuporto tayo kay Mayor Duterte. Meanwhile, Duterte addresses Kamala Commissioner Rowena Guanzon's challenge to all presidentials to undergo psychological testing. She must submit herself to a physical, mental aptitude. Bakit kami lang? Further, Duterte expressed his dismay on the recurrence of Laglag Bala issue, which now involved an elderly. Duterte says if he wins as president, all of the employees of NAIA may consider themselves resigned, retired, or transferred to other government offices. We will be assigned to other places. The whole of the contingent there. Wala, wala ko isa na. The mayor adds that the Philippine Enforcement Agency or PDEA must already be dissolved for its apparent non-performance to solve the rampant drug cases and that police personnel involved with crimes and other illegal drug activities be punished. PDEA disbanded, it's contaminated with corruption. Walay performance among yawa. Police sa Manila, they have to be dealt with harshly. On the other hand, Duterte just shrugged his shoulders on accusations of ill regard against women and reiterates the measures he has taken to ensure that women's welfare are upheld. Dito sa Dabao, there's a women's code, the first in, in the entire Philippines. Nila ninyo alam, ang maintindihan lang ninyo, remember ninyo, is the cuss words that I uttered when I was angry. Yun lang nalaman niya, hindi niyo alam na dito sa Davao, nauna kami sa lahat. May igdo kami. The Office of the Mayor provides lawyers for uh, women who are victims of battered. Yung binubugbog niya. Yung ginapaangkan. Duterte further reiterates that they do not let survey results dictate their actions. From Davao City, Joey Domingo reporting for Y News.